see this baby falling forward. That is the secret of how we all learn to walk and run. And you never understood the simple gravity science of how we all do it. This baby eventually learned to fall and lift to land on the other leg at the right height. The lift or jump is straight up while gravity pulls us forward. We cannot jump forward unless we fall forward first, then jump. Scientists see people doing their walking and running technique and analyze the physics wrong. There are three stages in a walk and run that we can analyze ourselves because gravity is simple enough for a child to understand. The first stage is picking up speed exponentially faster with each step to reach a level pace. Simply stated, our feet land to the rear and travel more to the rear. In the first stage, there is no slowdown phase in each stride because the leg is only slanted forward for gravity to pull us forward. The second stage is staying at a level pace. The feet land slightly out front so gravity slows us a little. The feet travel behind with the ground moving away so gravity picks up the speed you lost to make it a level pace. There is a slow down and pick up phase so gravity pulls you back and forward. The third stage is a slow down phase. The feet land out front and take off less out front there is no pickup phase because the leg is only slanted backward for gravity to pull us back. Air time is slow down time, so you should keep the jump as low as possible. The jump is not made to lengthen the stride, it is only to let you lean on the other leg at the right height.